Emery. Now, the Kenya Meteorological Department warned of continued heavy rains throughout May, particularly affecting Nairobi, the coastal region, Rift Valley, Central, and parts of Nyanza. This leading to the government echoing the urgency for people residing in riparian corridors and other water courses to vacate immediately to prevent disaster, as Chichi Josephine now tells us. The excessive rainfall that the country continues to receive has led to river and sewer overflow, transforming roads into waterways and causing great havoc in different parts of the country. In Nabarengo South, Longe One village has become the latest victim of the raging floods after it was marooned after heavy rains caused the Pekera and Molo rivers to burst their banks, displacing dozens of families. In the bridge. The flood waters have also wreaked havoc on surrounding villages, including Ilbule, Ipokanyaki, Leso, Rine, Morda, and parts of Loropil. Acres of maize plantations have been submerged causing significant agricultural losses. A joint rescue mission is currently underway with teams from the Red Cross, the county government and the national government working together to evacuate stranded residents. A Red Cross estimate suggests that over 500 people have been affected by the floods. The exercise will continue, especially ensuring that uh, no one is left behind, who will be at risk, of course, uh, for these challenges of uh, you know, flash floods. We're also calling upon the public to really take precaution measures in regards to the current advisories for anyone who is at risk, um, anyone who is in risk areas, to ensure that they evacuate or maybe evacuate to safer grounds. Elsewhere, Archbishop Martin Kivova of Mombasa Catholic Church urged the government to consider the construction of large dams to avert the recurring floods that have led to the death of more than 200 people. Serikali yetu inaweza kufanya maarifa na maarifa na wengi ambapo maji kama haya unaweza kuweka mabawa mabwawa ambayo yanaweza kushikilia maji yale yatumike kwa irrigation kwa sababu is a big waste japo kuna mafuriko baada ya muda mfupi maji haya yakisha in Isiolo County, over 1,200 households in Merti area have been displaced by floodwaters following a heavy downpour in the upper regions that has caused the Ewasonyuru River to break its banks. According to Haj Mohammed, an elder and businessman in Merti Town, the floods have wrecked havoc in the entire Merti subcounty, cutting off movement of people and goods in and out of Merti Town amid concerns that the area could soon run out of food supplies if the rains do not subside. Majumba hakuna. Ile jumba iko hai kama jumba kama hii. Angalia bande hii. Bande hii la imesingirwa haba imesingirwa. Chichi Josephine TV 47